Hi guys, Ben here. Um, um, just a quick uh, update video. Um, it's been a week or so. These are just sort of um, spontaneous pickups I've picked up in the last couple of weeks. You know, uh, very off the hook. You know, stuff I've just seen and gone, "Oh, I fancy that. I'll pick it up." Um, one record and a couple of sort of reissues that I sort of spontaneously found and decided, "Fuck it, I've got to order them." So yeah, um, I'll start with the vinyl. Um, Twin Peaks, a new series. Uh, was issued for record store day oh, sorry as you can see record store day uh, this year unfortunately on record store day my record store ran out pretty quick on these and I didn't turn up till quite late so yeah very surprised to see this um, you know a big fan of the music anyway big Twin Peaks fan I sort of bought it more as a collector's item really because you know it's just a stunning stunning picture disc yeah it's basically the Twin Peaks theme and yeah the songs that they played in the end of each episode in the in the bang bar thing in the bang bang bar um, so yeah it's got the chromatic shadow um, that nine inch now she's gone away and a few other good tracks on there so yeah massive fan of this and uh, yeah just a beautiful picture just kind of pick it had to pick it up right one of the, well I've got a couple of reissues here but onto the CDs Sacramentum's Far Away From The Sun. Not a massive fan of uh, a lot of black metal, but for me this is up with Dissection, Storm Of The Veins Light. I saw, I think this is the, it's a 2013 reissue and I saw it for £10 on Amazon. One of my favourite black metal albums, and in my opinion one of the best black metal albums of all time. You know, from the mid-90s when black metal was really at its peak, but yeah. Some of the uh, riffs on there are very sort of almost progressive, loads of twin dual guitar riffs that I like. So yeah, if you're a black metal fan or fan of sort of 90s metal, definitely check these guys out, particularly this album. And yeah, for you know, such a nice reissue, they've sort of, I think, redone the contrast slightly on the album artwork. I've never owned an original copy, but it sort of looks like they've just sharpened it up a little bit to me. Um, so yeah, fantastic album, definitely guy I picked it up. And another reissue, um, I mentioned this in my last video that I was tempted to pick it up, and I've listened to it a lot since, and six pound on Amazon I just had to grab the ball by the horns and buy it really uh, and that is Sabbath's classic Dreamweaver in my opinion their best album um, I know they only did three anyway but yeah History of Time is quite um, well acclaimed as well yeah this is the 2007 reissue which is 5 99 at the moment on on Amazon but yeah fantastic concept album fucking tight as hell playing on it you know Andy Sneaps guitar plans fantastic uh, for six pound you can't really go wrong you know if you're a big fan of classic uh, British thrash metal definitely check these guys out uh, particularly the song The Clerical Conspiracy which is one of my personal favourite tracks off here but yeah uh, great twin guitar playing you know riffs uh, underrated classic really so yeah definitely have to pick that up and something a little bit different just because you can't listen to metal all the time uh, I saw Andy I think post this in the video and I've listened to it a couple of times as well and I thought fuck it I've got to get that album as well uh, it's one of my favourites this year, you know, in terms of non-metal releases, and that's Turnstiles, Space and Time. Great hardcore punk record, you know, great sort of night. It's got sort of that early eight, uh, late eighties, early nineties sort of American hardcore skate punk sound. So, yeah, definitely check these guys out if you like uh, your punk a bit sort of hardcore, very fast, very tight, very fun and energetic. So yeah. Fantastic release and personally one of my favourite punk albums this year, if not my favourite punk album this year. So, yeah, definitely going to listen to this a few times. So, that's uh, the pickups the last couple of weeks. Um, not really much coming out at the moment, it's been a bit slow on new releases. So, I think for my next video, I might do a uh, sort of my favourite summer sort of albums, uh, summer playlist, because there's loads of shoegazy metal albums that have a bit of a summery sound to them. So yeah, let me go know what you guys have been listening to, uh, like and subscribe, and uh, I'll catch you soon.